Alright, here we go. Straight Shooter Coffee, the official coffee of Therapy Range. Alright guys, welcome back to another episode of Therapy Range. Today, we've got the Ruger Wrangler back out. 22 Wrangler from Ruger, 6.5 inch, 22 caliber revolver. No thumb safety on this one. Um, I speak very highly of this one because I've gotten really good results out of it over the, over the time that I've had it. So I figured I would bring this out and show you why I would prefer to have this pistol over the uh, Heritage Rough Riders. So without any further ado, let's shut up and shoot. It's therapy time. Let's go see what we got. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. And look at how nice and tight that group is. You know, it's a little looser than I would like. I would really like to see all of them right there on that little spot. But, you know, still, we didn't get anybody walking off like we did with the uh, Heritage 22, where we would get a group down here and then one would hit way off or, you know, get a group over here and one hit way off over there. Everything stayed right there, real tight, nice and tight together, about half the size of a pop can. Let's do it again. All right, so we got it loaded back up. We're gonna do this one more time and see if we can get consistency. Consistency was the worst problem that I had from the Heritage, is that there was just absolutely no consistency within the groups and patterns whatsoever. So um, yeah, let's do that. Yeah, let's do that. I got it loaded back up again. Again, today we're using the exact same ammo that we used in the last video. The exact same gun, exact same rest, exact same distance. Everything is exactly the same as the last uh, video that I did with this pistol, uh, except for my patch is different. You can check out all the awesome moral patches that I have available at www.patriotshit.com. That's my personal business. Your patronage is appreciated. Let's shoot this. I'll let you see the gun. Watch my awesome shooting skills. Let's go check it out. Okay then. One, two, three, four, five, six. And again, you know, just a little bit of walk off, but I'm gonna take credit for that. I don't think that was the gun. But this is what I'm actually looking for right here. That size of a group. At 35 feet, I think that that's the grouping that we should be having consistently more of. That one's not bad. This one's much better. And them two walking off, I mean, it's still a problem, but I think that's a problem that I have to work on. I think the only problem that the Ruger Wrangler has is that I need to just be a little bit more patient when I'm shooting. Uh, you know, getting anxious for the camera, trying to, to not let the video take too long. I may have pressed myself to get a, get a little bit quicker than I should have, but overall, the, the finish of this gun is, in my opinion, better. The trigger pull in this gun is, in my opinion, better. The quality of the materials that went into this gun is considerably better. I've not had any issues with screws backing out of it. I've not had any issues with uh, the gun, lo the cylinder rotating or anything locking the way it's supposed to. I've never had any issue with uh, spatter coming out. A lot of times in some of the cheaper guns, between the cylinder and the barrel, You'll sometimes get some powder that will burst out of there and come back and get you in the hand. Never had any of that. Uh, I used to have a Chippewa 
22 revolver that would do that. It was very annoying. But overall, you know, this gun runs about one, 189 to 200 bucks. The Heritage Rough Rider is going to run you around 129 to 159 something like that. Uh, this is going to be a higher quality gun. Is this the greatest gun 22 in the out there in the market? By no means does it qualify for that kind of a title. But for a budget 22 Plinkster, something that you can give your kids, your grandkids, your great grandkids, great 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 grandkids, I believe that the the function of this weapon will far surpass what you will get out of the uh, Heritage 22 revolvers. Those Rough Riders, they're 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 just. They're just cheaply made. They're super duper mass produced. You know, and these are too, but the quality control at Ruger far surpasses the quality surpasses the quality control over at Heritage. So that's all I've got for you guys today. I'm gonna keep this one short and sweet. We've already been through this once before, so make sure to check out the affiliate links in the link or in the description below. PatriotShit.com, Sure Shot Shooting Supplies, Straight Shooter Coffee. These are all good people that help therapy range to, to grow and be successful. They support America and they support American business and they're willing to take risk on Americans with ideas and people trying to live the American dream. Those are the kind of people that we as citizens really need to take the time to, to, to support and show love to. And that's all I've got to say about that today. Live your life to the fullest because anything less is an injustice to yourself and every single person around you. This is Paul Riley and this is Therapy Range. Stay free, America. We'll see you real soon. It's time to shut up and shoot. Hi, here we go.